A crazy Chinese electric car for $5,000? The mystery car from Alibaba. Isn't that shocking as well as amazing to know that there is an electric car just the same as Hot Wheels? We are all die-hard fans of Hot Wheels, for sure. On that note, we're all surely going to love this amazing model, but we have to check out the features of this mysterious car. Welcome back to Voltify. In today's video, we will be seeing the features of this crazy Chinese electric car worth $5,000. Is that really worth the price? Is it of any use? Let's check it out. Before getting into this super exciting video, subscribe to our channel for more such amazing videos. Stay tuned till the end to know the pros and cons of this electric car. People all around the world are converting to electric cars. Indians are beginning to recognize the advantages and competency of EVs. Electric vehicles are becoming more and more common in India, to the point that spotting one on the country's roadways no longer commands any notice. There will undoubtedly be a lot of electric vehicles in the future, however you may already purchase a range of electric vehicles in India. There is an EV for nearly any budget, thanks to the consistent range, abundance of high-end amenities, and price range of these EVs. But the adoption of electric vehicles in India still faces some challenges, such as the lack of adequate charging infrastructure and limited battery range anxiety among drivers. Nevertheless, as the technology improves and infrastructure expands, it is expected that the number of electric vehicles on Indian roads will continue to grow, leading to a cleaner and greener future for the country. Chinese electric car, the Mini EV, retails at roughly $5,000 new. It would be more expensive to specify the cigar humidor glove box option on a Rolls Royce or add Apple CarPlay to a Ferrari than it would be to purchase the Mini EV altogether. The author of DIY Lithium Batteries and the Ultimate DIY Ebike Guide, Micah Toll, hosts a weekly series called Awesomely Weird Alibaba Electric Vehicle of the Week. Its mission is to discover the coolest and most fun electric vehicles from China that either drive, float, or fly. His most recent discoveries include a Pepto-Bismol pink electric automobile that sells for $5,000, an electric train set that can hold up 500 kilograms and an inflatable electric jet ski. Wu Ling's Mini EV has been so popular that not only are Chinese manufacturers quickly producing knockoffs, but Wu Ling itself is busy producing other variants of the vehicle, including a planned cabriolet and a long range version. A three way collaboration resulted in the Wu Ling Hongguang Mini EV. SAIC Motor is the major partner, owning 50.1% of the company. SAIC, one of China's largest automotive businesses, it was second in volume in 2021, is likely best recognized in Europe as the new owner of MG. Yamamoto noticed that the majority of the parts were off the shelf and about consumer quality rather than automotive grade. As a result, the Mini EV is more likely to encounter problems, but it will also be less expensive to fix. The Hongguang Mini EV sold 112,000 units in the second half of 2020, ranking second only to Tesla's Model 3 produced in its Shanghai facility. Five Chinese officials summoned Tesla earlier this month on quality and safety issues at its facility. After the United States, China is Tesla's second largest market. In January, Hongguang mini sales nearly doubled Tesla's. It is now thought to be the world's second best-selling electric vehicle, trailing only the Model 3. At the same time, BYD, widely known for its investment by U.S. investor Warren Buffett and its low price, has unveiled Yang Wang U8, its first 1 million yuan electric car. The name literally means look up to with admiration. According to the National Bureau of Statistics, China's manufacture of new energy cars increased by 91% last year to reach 7 million. Electric vehicles accounted for one in every four 
more automobiles sold in China last year, and manufacturing is anticipated to increase dramatically again this year. BAW has launched the Yuanbao, a small electric vehicle for the Chinese market that will compete with the popular Wuling Hongguang Mini EV, as well as the extremely similar Cherry QQ Ice Cream and Dongfeng Fengguang Mini EV models. The BAW Yuanbao's design is eerily similar to that of its successful rivals, with two-box dimensions, squared lighting units, small 13-inch wheels, and simplistic aesthetic cues. Vibrant colors such as the shown pink are available to entice female purchasers, who are the primary target audience for this sort of car. According to Car News China, the Yuanbao moniker refers to a sort of gold and silver ingot employed in Imperial China that denotes prosperity and might. With that, we come to the middle of this video. We will see in the rest of the video some more features of this amazing and cute little electric vehicle in China. Before that, do not forget to subscribe to our channel for more such amazing and interesting videos. Chinese manufacturers who face severe competition and a pricing war at home have long sought markets abroad. Domestic electric car makers have an advantage in many ways due to government development incentives, quick technology developments, and a well-established supply network. In 2022, China's auto exports will have increased by 54.4% to more than 3.1 million cars. However, increased exports risk provoking protectionist measures from a other countries. For a repurposed golf buggy, a range of 80 to 120 kilometers is pretty darn impressive, and that's particularly true given that many second-hand Nissan Leafs would have trouble reaching those numbers. Actually, the 4,000-watt motor and 7.2-kilowatt-hour battery make for a respectable powertrain. The only drawback, or perhaps one of the drawbacks, is that this sightseeing car has a sticker price of $5,500, which is more than double what my tiny truck cost. However, if you buy three of them, the vendor offers to take a significant $200 off the price. That is the deal of the century, people, at least until you double or treble that sum to account for all the additional expenses related to importing a car from abroad. A drag race or tug of war between the two would be a fascinating competition because it has a little more power and battery than I have in my Chinese electric mini truck. I'm not sure how much practical use you'd get out of this Alibaba special, considering the fact that this is most definitely not a street legal car in the US or most other countries. Although it probably won't make a very good utility vehicle, your golf cart would be the coolest on the course. And with a car this good looking, I have to assume the police would let you go without a ticket or at the least issue you a warning if you were to stray a little too far from the golf course. The EV market's competitiveness is moving in favor of mid-range vehicles. The Benben E-Star and QQ Ice Cream both stopped taking orders for the lowest selections, which were each valued at about 30,000 yuan in April. Aura has chosen to focus her efforts on the Good Cat model, which sells for more than 140,000 yuan. According to the official website of Alibaba, the cost of this new toy-like EV is between 5,000 and 5,600 dollars. With that, we come to the close. What do you think about the little cute electric car? Is it worth it? Are you guys going to get one for you? Comment below your opinion. If you enjoyed the video, do not forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Bye!